professional YouTuber my behind. If you could see the janky camera setup right now, you'd all be cracking up. When you watch Graveyard Girl and she talks about having her camera on a bunch of boxes. Yeah. Yeah, basically. <laughs> Holy moly. Anyway, it works for the moment. Hi everybody, how are you right now this month? Um, I am here to bring you the challenge I gave to my design team for my product line this month. It was a good one. Last month was, um, last month was Cutter Punch. I really want the design team to think outside the box with the products from my store and supplement that with whatever they need to to create something unique and different, and they're doing a bang up job so far. Uh, as per usual, as often as I can, um, every, at the very least, every other week or so, I go to the website, the design team blog page, the link is in the description below, and I add in and link all the videos for all the design team members. I link it next to their name, um, so you all can just go there and you can find what the current videos are. If the link doesn't work, it's because they don't have a video that's out yet. Um, and um, you can, maybe you have a favorite one of the design team members and you want to see what they've done and you can go there and check out their videos. They're, they're doing a great job. Um, if I can, I'm going to try to link all their videos um, to date in the description below so you can check down there too. So last month we had Cutter Punch. This time, this month it was Sparkly Dimensional and Texture. And I didn't remember that that's what it was for this month for May until a couple, literally a couple minutes ago when I went to go look at my notes. Hello, notes. And it's so funny that I issued them that challenge and then forgot about it. Because what have I been playing with this last month? sparkly dimensional texture. <laughs> Everything from um, sparkly rainbow resin tumblers, I'll insert some pictures here, um, to um, petri dish style resin um, embellishments and magnets that I'm gonna be, hopefully if they turn out, I'm selling them in the Etsy shop, so I'll put them here, um, along with handmade paper which I don't make a ton of. I don't make it in big batches. I make about 12 sheets at a time. Um, and um, you get two and a half sheets um, in the Etsy shop. I do have a few in the Etsy shop. Um, along with the stamps and the stencils, I do at this time of filming this have six new stencils on the way from the UK. They're not here yet at the time of filming, but they're on the way. Um, hopefully, um, by the time you all see this, they'll be here, um, or shortly thereafter. But there are six new modern atomic designs coming out. If you remember correctly, at the beginning of the year, I decided designed something like 18 or something designs for the modern atomic series, and we only released six of them at the beginning of the year, so it's time to release six new ones. And I have in mind some new designs that I have to actually redraw to make them into stamps and stencils. Um, we have the Black Paper Doodle series that I did, which is a digital, you can get it as a digital download. You can also get it as stickers. It's all av also available on merch. Um, I'll insert some pictures here and um, they'll, there is links in the description. Um, I recently got myself a pair of the leggings, which I can't wait to wear. I haven't worn them yet. They literally just came today. Um, and I ordered myself some fabric, so I'm going to be making myself a shirt. Why, why I'm back to sewing, I don't know. That's a whole other video. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's been an interesting month, and the designs are just coming and flowing, and my brain is full of them, and I'm pushing them out as fast as I can, and I can't wait to see what the design team comes up and does with some of them. Um, I, I think I'm pushing out some of them at them too fast, but... <laughs> but that's how they're coming to me, I'm sorry. Um, but they've so far been doing a great job and I would love to see what they do next and I can't wait to see along with, I'm sure, all of you. Um, so go check their channels out, show them some love. 
Uh, like, share, and subscribe to everybody's channel, if you will. If you want to follow me on social media to see what I'm up with up to on a daily basis, because I do have a daily art practice that I do, daily drawings. Um, or you want to support the free content here on YouTube or over on Facebook. Of course, you can buy any of my merchandise over on Etsy. I have a Teespring. I've got Society6. You can get the fabric over at Spoonflower and all of that jazz. Um, but again, I'm uh, putting some pictures here in the video of some new things that I've come up with that are just wonderful. The fabric is cool. In fact, hang on, hang on, hang on. You're going to see a bright light. Hang on. One of the fabrics you can order is knit. And this are the, this is a sample of the black paper doodles on knit fabric. Isn't that cool? I can't wait to do something with that. So I've got lots of different designs, and this is from Spoonflower. So I've got lots of different things coming up and um, that are already out that are pretty exciting. And yeah, so check it out. And let's see what the design team does and uh, see what they're up to. And meanwhile, I'll keep up with the craziness. I, I, yeah, I don't know. I keep making stuff. So I'll keep doing it. All right, that's it for the moment. Um, go show everybody some love, like, share, and subscribe. Uh, check out the links in the description below. And, and the most important thing is to go out and have a great day, people. Do something nice for yourself because you deserve it, and I'll see you later. Bye, guys.